Hey everyone, I am Miss Turner and I am going to show you how to use base 10 manipulatives. Um, we have hundreds, tens, and ones to solve a three digit addition problem with regrouping. So we have regrouping in the ones and tens place in this problem. Um, so you'll be able to see how to use these manipulatives to solve this problem. As you can see in the problem, I've lined up my ones, my tens, and my hundreds. And I will do the same when I compose the two numbers. So first, we ask our students to compose the numbers. So we have 300 So three, three hundreds, four tens, one, two, three, four, and seven ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that's the first step. You want your student to be able to make the two numbers. So we have two hundreds, two in the hundreds place, one, two, seven tens, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and five ones. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, when we add, we always start in the ones place. So using the manipulatives, we will add these two, the ones together. And seven plus five is going to be 12 ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So our students know that 10 ones make a 10. We cannot put any number higher than nine in the ones place. So we cannot have 12 here. So what we can do is we can regroup. We can change out 10 of the ones for a tens rod. So I'm gonna take 10 ones and replace it with a um, tens rod. And so I'll still have my two ones left over. All right, so then we've added our ones. So we'll have a two there. Then we have our tens that we need to add. So we will add all of this together. So our seven ten, oh no, our four tens, our seven tens, and our one ten. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So we have twelve tens rods. And our students know that ten tens makes a one hundred. So we can trade out ten tens. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten for a one hundred. Okay, so we'll put that there. And we have two tens left over out of those 12 tens. And then we are moving into our hundreds place and we will add those together as well. So now we will write our answer. This is what we have left. There's nothing for us to regroup here or to move over. So we have two tens, I mean two ones, sorry, two tens and one, two, three, four, five, six hundreds. So our answer is 622. And for those of you who know just standard algorithm, we know that seven plus five is 12. We will regroup our 10 and put our ones in the ones place. Seven plus four is 11 and one more is 12. So we regroup our, our 100 and put our two tens there. And then we have to add our hundreds place. Three, four, five, six. So our answer is 622.